half five in the evening. I've been glossing the annex all day. I'm watching the Formula One. Mum has just finished the last bit of the upholstery for the van, so I wanted to grab my camera and show you guys putting it in and it finally being done. Curtains are already in, but Mum's gonna steam them so they fold up nicely. And then we can put the seats in. I'm gonna hoover it out a little bit before that as well, but getting all the old stuff out, new stuff in, curtain steamed. That's what we're doing. She's lighter already. Just as a, uh, a reference, this is the old seat base and that's what it looked like. It's quite a cool material. It's all falling apart and it's just been recovered. <laughs> Gross, useless. It's out. This isn't mine, this is mum's scarf, and it's not, it's not part of the band. These are my tie backs. Aren't they pretty? Cans are in. Don't they look awesome? Uh, for those of you who watched my last video, if you haven't, link is. I always get that one up somewhere, go check that out. But in my last video, I was remaking uh, this shelf up here and it's back in, as you can see. The bottom is now nice and nice and white. Doors went nicely. I think it looks so much better than it did and I can't wait to get my, I'm sitting on bare wood at the moment. I can't wait to get my new cushions in here. I think we're gonna do it tomorrow because dad's cooking a barbecue. Also need to get the, uh, the tire cover on as well, wheel cover, but now it's barbecue time so I'll probably see you tomorrow when I'm hoovering and putting everything else in. morning lovely day here just been for a bike ride it's almost 11 o'clock now had some breakfast i was also just watching uh jacob collier's tiny desk concert which it's got like four of him in a room super cool everything he does is just awesome so go check that out so yeah i'm just gonna grab the hoover or vacuum cleaner depending on where you're from and clean my van out uh, ready to put everything back in it exciting times and then the formula one is on so i'll be watching that also don't um don't judge me for not making my bed. In fact, I'll do it right now. Happy? Now we can go. video which if you haven't what are you doing I mentioned about my curtain tracks and how I just screwed them up which wasn't really true and it gave me a lot more hassle than that basically the track was hanging off at the back both sides because the screws had come out and I was having difficulty finding screws that would go in to the track so I've had to drill new holes in the body which I didn't like doing but I did that found screws that sort of fit in I had to kind of force them in and they bent the track and then I had to file them down and use wet and dry and it probably took about two or three days altogether um, I'll show you what I mean whoever put this track up had put screws in and then shaved the head of the screw off so I can't get them out if I wanted to so that's why I tried to salvage this track so this is one that I did I had to kind of drill out a piece of the track to get the screw in 
and then I filed it down once it's in. Um, that one, there's one there, and one at the back. Or two at the back, and the same that side. Out of all the jobs that I kind of thought, oh, I'll just do that. No, no, that was a pain. I made the old track work. I think it was a lot less work than probably putting a new one on, but curtains are up, it works, so I'm happy. All right, back to cleaning. <laughs> show you a before and after I think. This is my dirty roof and now it's clean. Okay, I'm done cleaning. I got a bit carried away and did the pop top concertina thing and then I did the floor and the benches uh, in the back. I'm done. Then I'm gonna have lunch and watch the Formula One and then put all the cushions in. These are the two buddy seat cushions, the base and the back, and then this is my wheel cover, um, which we'll put on here. First we're going to put on the buddy seat cushion. Let's go. Right, so this is the bottom of the buddy seat. Other way up? We'll put it this way up. <laughs> cool. Next. Okay, that was aggressive. This is the back. Oh. And we have these little poppers on the side. And one that side as well that I'll do. Looks lovely. New buddy seat. Alright, next up we have uh, the mattress part at the back of the van here, and then I'll put the seating in after that. But mattress back. <laughs> I'll show you later as well. The piping on this is the same material as the buddy seat and then we've got a more plain material for the actual cover itself. I think it looks really nice. Looks good. Okay, next up is the rest of the bed that makes the seat. So we have bottom. What do you guys think? Let me know in the uh, comments below. Alright, I think that's about it for this video. Doesn't it look great? I'm really pleased with it. Huge thank you to my mum who made all of this by hand from scratch. Feels like I'm putting my stamp on it now. It feels more like my van, which is great. Oh, also, since my last video, I've passed the 200 subscriber mark, which is really cool. So thank you to everyone who is subscribing. If you're watching this and you're not subscribed, consider doing so. Uh, it would make me very happy and help me a lot. I'm sorry, I went for a bike ride this morning. I didn't shower, so this whole video has been like just me being gross on camera. I'm not clean, but my van is. That's all that counts. So, cheers. Um, like I said, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, um, subscribe if you haven't already. So yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Until then, take care, subscribe, and be a nice human being. All right, bye bye.